Hi guys, welcome back to another video. It's Dan here from Sports Cars UK and in today's video we have the Pro Set 1990-91 to season collector card box. So we've got this whole box to open. In here we have, let's go tell us on the box, 48 packs with 9 cards per pack. So it's a lot to get through, it's probably going to be a long video, but hope you uh Follow me through throughout the whole video. And what we're looking for is uh, a lot of the rookies for people like Alan Shearer. We've got a Roy Keane rookie in here and an Ian Wright. So they're the three that we're probably looking for the most. Um, if there are any others, do let me know. Um, and we'll see if we can hit all three of those. would be nice. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Okay, so I have, for those of you who are wondering, ordered this from uh, the US. Um, I have ordered a, a I got a couple of boxes from the same seller to kind of, uh, well, it makes sense to get it from the same seller to kind of save on the, the shipping costs and taxes and whatnot. Um, if you are thinking about investing in these, I think it is a good investment. I'd probably use something like Get It Shipped International or Ship My Cards to maybe send multiple boxes to a US address and then get them all shipped over at once. That way you'll save on um, multiple tax fees and multiple shipping fees. So it does uh, it does pay to use uh, one of those services. I have got experience in using Get It Shipped International and I would recommend using those guys as I have used them uh, previously and I know a few people use Ship My Cards as well. Right, so let's get this open. I have got, a, as I said, I did order two boxes, so I have got another one which I'm going to keep sealed. Um, I do think it's worth keeping the boxes, or having sealed boxes. I think it's one of the best investments that you can make. So we've got a lot of packs to get through here. A lot, a lot of packs. So let's go through this first lot and then see how we do. And then we can tackle this second lot afterwards. Look at all of these, look. And let's see if we can hit one of those rookies. So these are kind of really flimsy packs and they are really, really easy to nick and um, and damage. So we have to be fairly careful. You can see the cards have got a lot of whitening on them already. So we've got Lasso, Lukic, Paul Parker, Platt, Richard Shaw, Alan Cork, Jury and Stapleton. So there will be some names that I recognise and obviously there will probably be some ones that I don't as well. Oh, I thought we had a Shearer there. We've got a Russell Osman, Armstrong, Megson, um, Gabbiadini, Emerson, uh, McAvaney, Sanchez, Andy Garner, Oh, nice Teddy Sheringham. Maybe we'll keep that to one side. And a uh, Owen Archdeacon. So I do own a Roy Keane rookie myself, but I'd like to pick up another few. Maybe pick pick one up pack fresh. It'll mean a bit more. you got Andy Thorne, Kevin Sheedy, Steve Ball, who I think is on the front of the box. Yeah, he is. Don't know if that's a good thing or not. Oh, a nice Gary Lineker. Gordon Strachan, Lee Martin, Chris Fairclough, Ian Brightwell, and Phil Gee. Just have to throw the packets on the floor, I think. Um, Bruce Grobola, John Scales, John Fashion Fashionu. Oh, nice. A car that I do actually own, I picked up for about a pound, Paul Gascoigne. Uh, Romadia, sorry, Romeo Zondervan. Gordon Cowas, uh, Falcao. Falco, sorry, not, Fal not Falcao. Alan Hansen, uh, obviously used to be on the um, match of the day. And uh, then we got Ian Bishop. Jeff Thomas, Brian Gunn, Steve Chettle, Steve Hodge, 
Nigel Clough, Eddie McGoldrick, Phil Barber, Ian Crook, and Glenn Hodges. Steve Bold, Eric Thorsdevelt, Thors, Thorsdevet, not sure about him. Uh, Dave Beeson, Kiwo, Kimwamia, Peter Shelton, goalkeeper there. I have got his uh, Spania 82 uh, sticker. Obviously, uh, Maradona scored a hand of God goal against uh, Peter Shelton. He's still pretty bitter about that. <laughs> He still talks about it now. You've got Paul Blades, Michael Thomas, Steve Sedgley, and Robert Fleck. I do like the simple design of these cards, and they have got some good action so shots as well. Uh, we've got Mark Crossley, Paul Hardyman, Martin Keown. Nice, we'll keep that. Um, I did actually see a, a rookie of Martin Keown recently. Uh, nearly picked it up, but then I didn't bother in the end. Glenn Heisen. Tony Adams, the famous Arsenal player, Andy Gray, uh, Gary Parker, Andy Hitchcliffe, and Gary Mubbett. You got Paul Birch, David Barnes, Carlton Fairweather, Gary Stevens, Gary Pallister for uh, United, Gillespie, Terry Phelan. Mike Phelan and Gary Speed, RIP Gary Speed. Tragically uh, took his life, unfortunately. We've got Les Seeley, Rule Fox, Alan Harper. Yay! Looks in nice condition as well. We have got some nicks up at the top there. But. We have got the one card I actually really wanted to hit, and he is um, a part of my PC now, Roy Keane. So I have been picking up a lot of uh, a lot of Roy Keane cards as of recent. Um, we can even stick him in this fancy looking top loader. There we go. So we've got our our guy up at the top, David uh, Rowcastle, Ian Marshall. Norman Whiteside, Del Gordon, Alan McDonald, and finally we end off the pack with Trevor Herbert. I've kind of got a little pile of people that I sort of am familiar with or or know a fair amount about. Um, so that's kind of sometimes you might be like you might be like, why have you got Gary Pallister on the good pile? On the good pile, just because, just because really, probably be the ones that I keep. Julian James, Ian Dowie. I did actually watch a, a podcast of Ian Dowie, uh, Under the Kosh podcast. I'd recommend their podcast. They do, um, they interview uh, all, all different types of footballers. And the Ian Dowie one was actually really, really, really good. So he um, famously played for, who's he playing for here? Luton. Um, and who else did he play for? Was it West Ham? I think so, yeah. He played for West Ham for a lot of his career. Um striker I believe um, yeah Ian scored 80 goals in a two and a half seasons with Hendon and won Northern Ireland international recognition and he became uh, a manager uh, towards the end of his career as well Stuart Pearce let's keep Ian Dowie to one side because I didn't watch that podcast Matt Letizia again another famous player uh, Kevin Gallagher Nigel Jemson John Humphrey Lloyd McGrath and Brian Dean. It's interesting to see what teams are in the, uh, the Premier League at the time as well. You got Glyn Snowden, or First Division, uh, Stuart Gray, Mel Sterland, Neil Poynton, Trevor Peak, Peter Reed. Barry Horn and Mohamed Amar. Oh, and one more Lee Power for Norwich.
you got Mike Newell, Paul Bracewell, Dave Watson, Ian Rush, the famous player, Mal Donaghy, Chris White, uh, Terry Gibson, Andy Much, and Paul Stewart, the Spurs. We've got Paul McGrath, Wilf Ruston, Andrew Heath, Neville Southall, Paul Merson. Uh, he was on a, a TV show I watched with uh, Razor Ruddock. He was famously, um, I don't want to say he was famous for this. He was a famous footballer, but he, I saw a, a sort of a program that talked about his alcoholism and his gambling, um, which obviously can be a, a thing we've seen as a, as a thing with, um, with football back then. A lot of them did used to, to drink quite heavily. You've got Brian Laws, uh, Tony Agana, Trevor Francis and Bergson to finish us off. We've got Portsmouth in the league as well. Um, Pat Van de Hoor. Don't know too much about him. Kevin Wilson. Nigel Webb. John Barnes. Nice uh, John Barnes there. Famous uh, English striker. Uh, Cersei Evan, Sari Evans. Ian Olney. Neil Ruddock. There we go. Razor Ruddock. So we'll put him to one side. to just mention him and he just popped up. Brett Angle. Uh, Dennis Wise, which is backwards, not sure why. Um, a Steve Davis and a Alan Knight. We got a Lars Elstrup, Gary Shivers, Jerry McElhenney, I think, Peter Billing, uh, Churjink. Ooh, don't know that one. Slater, definitely butchered that. John Kay, uh, Jan, we'll go with, and Mark Wright for Derby. We got Mick Adams, Ray Wilkins, Derek Mountfield, Ian Butterworth, John Byrne, Clayton Blackmore, Paul Beasley. Gary Robson, Mark Ward, and John Dreyer. We've got Gary Owers, Kevin Campbell, Andy Sinton, Veradi, Jeff Eckhart, Mark Chamberlain, Kevin Ratcliffe, Steve Walsh and Tony Cotty, coat. Too sure there for Chelsea, it looks like. No, Everton. Everton. Regis, Ian Snowden, Paul Davis for Arsenal, Mel Sage, Kevin Bond, David Beardsley, Martin Hodge, Dean Crombie and Steve Staunton. Start off this pack with Alec Chamberlain, Keith Curl, L. Barrett, Tim Flowers, Lee Sinnott, Dean Glover, Steve Cherry. Danny Wallace for United and Andy Ritchie. So we've got about five, no, yeah, five more packs, including this one, left to go for the first half. Jason Rees, David Lee, Kent Nilsson, David Phillips, Rod Wallace, Tony Cascarino. <laughs> I keep knocking this thing. All right, chat on the floor. Mick Quinn, uh, John Pearson, and Julian Dix to finish us off. Four more packs to go. No Shearer, no Ian Wright as of yet. Uh, Mick McCarthy, 
Mick McCarthy, obviously famously captained uh, Ireland and sent Roy Keane home <laughs> in, from the World Cup, um, which was uh, which was pretty sad. Um, and there was that famous uh, interview of Roy Keane walking his dog Triggs. Um, he obviously sadly passed away, but that was some time ago now. But yeah, about 20 years ago. And uh, yeah, Mick McCarthy famously sent um, uh, Roy Keane home as uh, when they went to, I think it was Saipan. Um, the training regiment was, Keane said, was kind of lacklustre. There wasn't uh, some of the, the team hadn't turned up. The goalkeepers weren't there. Um, and so he was quite frustrated with um, with Mick McCarthy. Um, so, yeah, famous uh, famous duo, I suppose, Roy Keane and Mick McCarthy. Simon Barker, Steve Redmond, Glenn Cockrell, uh, Rob Newman, Brian Robson, Lee Sharp. Insert the clip of uh, Lee Sharp, Lee Sharp. My UK viewers will definitely know where that's from. Maybe the US, not too sure. Steve Bruce and Rod Thomas. I hope I can put that in and not get copyright. I'm sure I can. Uh, we've got Mark Stein, Gary Crosby, Nigel Winterburn, Mitchell Thomas, Malcolm Allen, David Seaman. Very nice. Look at that strong stash there. One of England's probably top five, top three goalkeepers. Paul Ince, another good one for uh, for United. Ian Baird and Carl Bradshaw. I think was Paul Ince one of the... Was Paul Ince the first black man to captain the England squad? Yeah, he was. So he became England's first black captain in 1993, where he led the three lines against the United States. Good fact about Paul Ince. Um, Darren McDonoghue, John Burridge, Fraser Digby, Kevin Morgan, sorry, Moran, Kerry Dixon, Reese Wilmot, Mark Hughes for United there. Tony Norman and John Ebrell. You'll notice probably a lot of, a lot of names and sort of uh, commentators or punditry um, or managerial careers as well. So it's interesting to see a lot of these players uh, in this set that have come, come on to be successful managers or uh, be successful outside post uh, playing, playing professional football. Roger Joseph, Ian Culverhouse, Gary Shelton, Dean Saunders, Tommy Caton, uh, Franz Carr, Robert Rosario, cool name, Ian Cook, Crook, Gary Albert, Ablett, and to finish us, oh no, we still got another pack, Craig Ramage. So one more pack. I think we'll do a second half of the video, uh, opening up the second, uh, second lot of cards. So we've got Glyn Snod Snodin for our first pack. Last pack, sorry. Paul Bracewell, Dave Watson, Ronnie Whelan, Nigel Martin, Seri Evans, Ronnie Rosenthal, Jimmy Quinn, and Stuart McCall to finish us off. So quite a lot of cards there. A few doubles, but not many. So it's quite nice to, to see that when you buy an entire box, you probably not close to or maybe close to finishing the uh, the entire set there is a humongous amount of cards in the set it will tell me somewhere on here um let's have a look oh shit oh maybe it doesn't maybe on the bottom let's try and... oh no there is nothing on the bottom uh oh i don't know if you know how many cards there are in the set let me know Surprised it doesn't say on here. Nine photo and fact cards per pack. So that one that was upside down, was that a fact card? Let's have a look. I know which one it was. It was the, this one, Dennis Wise. 
No, it doesn't look any different. Maybe we'll check the backs. What's a fact card then? Maybe we'll see in the second part then what a fact card is. I don't think we've come across one just yet. Unless they're these... Are they the turquoise backs? Or is that just a... No, I think that's just the series which they're in. Let me know what are the fact cards. Maybe we'll, we'll, we'll have a look in part two. But some of the hits, some of the names that I recognise, there was quite a few that I put over there, but... These are the ones that I, I put down. We've got Mark Hughes, Paul Ince, David Seaman, Steve Bruce, Lee Sharp, Brian Robson, Mick McCarthy, Dennis Wise, Neil Ruddock, John Barnes, Paul Merson, Ian Rush, Matt Letissier, Ian Dowie, Stuart Pearce, Gary Pallister, Tony Adams, Martin Keown, Alan Hansen, Paul Gascoigne, Gary Lineker and Teddy Sheringham. What a set, really. Some, some great names there. And I'll highlight the rookie, or the one that I was after. I'll, there might be other rookies in here. If there are, let me know. In fairly good condition. Happy with this. Corners seem fairly sharp. Just some whitening over on this right-hand side. Don't know if you can see that. But this is the Pro Set rookie card, 1990, of Roy Keane in his Nottingham Forest shirt. Very, very nice. So that was part one. I hope you did enjoy this. Um, obviously, do stay tuned for part two. I'll release that fairly soon after I release uh, part one, probably the week after. Um, so do stick around for that. Hopefully, we can pick up a Shearer and an Ian Wright. If we could pick up one of the, each of those, I'll be extremely happy. And then we've hit all of the rookies that we're after. So that'd be really, really good. If you did enjoy this video, um, I thoroughly and did. I, I enjoyed looking at all of the, uh, the, the players from the past. Uh, from the 90s can't say i was around for this era of football i wasn't actually born at this point um hopefully that doesn't make some of the older viewers of my channel feel too old but uh, <laughs> some of the players kind of growing up i mean this is roy Keane's rookie rookie card so i mean he's probably about 1920 here so i remember seeing him in the kind of the early mid 2000s so yeah, I hope you did enjoy this. If you did, please do drop a big like on the video. Uh, make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. And I'll see you for part two. Thanks very much. Mm -hmm.